Hey guys, this is Fimray91, and I'm continuing my series of how to off meta, and today we're talking about Renata ADC. Now, Renata is usually looked upon as just a sub. Now, Renata is relatively new. In fact, I think she's the newest champion to be added to the roster, and it seems like she was kind of made to be a sub. Many of her moves seem more sub-like, but did you know that Renata can actually be a really good ADC? I played this a bunch, and she is pretty good. However, you have to play her very differently than I imagine you would play her if you were playing Renata Sup. And speaking of Sup, that's the first thing I want to talk about. No Yumis. That's basically it. Just, just no Yumis. Basically, every other Sup is good with Renata. Even, even though I find usually the Stunners or the Pokers are probably the best Sup. The Luxes, the Nautiluses, the Brands, those are the really good Sups for her. But basically, any Sup can work for her other than Yumi. No Yumi. Well, now that we got that out of the way, runes. Now, press the attack is probably the biggest rune I'd suggest for her. The other runes can really be up to your discretion, but I really think she needs press the attack as it really helps her, especially like probably early and late. Items. Immortal Shield Bow and Ginsu's Rage Blade. Now, why, why Immortal Shield Bow and not Kraken Slayer? Because I think the extra health and everything helps her. Plus, I think she really needs that shield because it really works well with her W because the shield gives her time to really get that enemy's health down and then she can use her W which obviously if she does die gives her an extra three seconds to kill the enemy or for someone to kill the enemy to actually stop her from dying. Playstyle. Speaking of her W, that's what you really want to focus on. You want to learn all three moves at first but you definitely want that W to be really high really early. It really helps you out so much. Early game, late game, that W really does work. So you want to focus mainly on the W and then the E second and then the Q. Now when it comes to the actual laning phase, you can really play her in a variety of ways. There's not just one way to play this type of ADC. You can actually do the minion game where you basically just last hitting minions to try to gain a lot of CS. Now the reason why Renata is so good with this is because her first attack on a minion actually does more damage than adjacent attacks. So you can re definitely play the minion game with her, but you don't have to. You can actually go in on the enemy champions relatively early. Renata, if you learn her E first, you can slow them down and then get some hits in, and depending on what type of sup you have, you can even get some kills early sometimes. So there's a good amount of different ways to play her, but definitely her W. Even with playstyle, her W is really needed. It helps you to chase champs. It also helps you if they kill you and then maybe you can get them before the W actually expires. but So, in reality, there's many ways to play her, but basically, focus on W, and if you want, you can play the minion game. Okay, let's summarize. Sup, anyone but Yumi. Runes, press the attack. That's basically the biggest one that you need. Items, Immortal Shield Bow and Ginsu's Rage Blade. It really helps her with both attack speed and damage. Play style, really focus W. But also, she's a very good last hitter. Now, the only ADC that I say stay away from here is Samira. In fact, I would recommend banning Samira. She is just so good against Renata ADC. All the other ADCs, no. But Sam will kill Renata. That's just like, she seems to be Renata's at least main counter when it comes to ADCs. But other than that, Renata can handle basically all the other ADCs. Yes, I haven't placed all the other ADCs, but... All the other ones I've faced, she can handle. But what do you guys think about Renata ADC? Do you guys think you're going to try this? Or have you tried this? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. And may God bless you all.